This is another Blender 2.68 tutorial. This time we'll cover how to do the lighthouse for the landscape project. And we'll want to load up our file. And if you don't know where your home folder is, you're going to go all the way down to the root, go to volumes, home folder, and then so on. Okay, we need to select a camera in order to do a test render. GZ, I'm going to bring the camera up and accept that. GX, move the camera away. GY, and move the camera away in this direction. Okay, I'm going to rotate the camera now. This view. And we can do transform, numeric transform, it makes it easier. And let's I'm zooming out the Z. No, nope, that's not. There's the Y. Bring in camera view. Apparently that's not what we want to do. Minus 90, minus 180. Okay, so we're in overhead view. That makes it easier to adjust. We want to rotate in this direction. And look at the camera view again. I'm going to pan up just a little bit, so we need minus 250. Okay, let's try to render that. And the lighting's no good. We're going to adjust the light. And let's grab it and move it in the X direction. And move it into the Z direction. So that's GZ. And let's try rendering that again. It's a little bit better. We probably want to have smooth on. So let's select our object. There we go. Or you can leave it jagged, however you like. And render again. Okay, so now we want to add our lighthouse. Now we want to add a lighthouse. So we want to add a circle. And Let's make the house, uh, lighthouse uh, eight meters in radius. Oh, that's too big. Let's make this four meters. That looks better. And we will move it. Birds. And we'll move it back. Okay, that's not where a lighthouse is supposed to go. It's supposed to go to the furthest point, but that doesn't matter for our project. Okay, go into edit mode. And the first thing we want to do, well, let's get in a little closer. OK, 
Okay, we want to extrude. So that'll keep the points there, duplicate them. Then we want to go straight up. So that's up eight meters. You can always type in hard numbers. Okay, now we want to make make this lighthouse tapered. And we'll just taper it slightly. Now we want to extrude again. And we don't want to move it. We just want to scale it so it go out, goes outwards. Create a bit of a lip. And then hit spacebar to accept. Now we want to extrude, and this time we want to go vertical again. And let's lock in. Spacebar to accept. And we want to extrude again. Just come up a little bit just to and then hit S. There we go. And leave it there and hit spacebar to accept. Extrude again, go up and lock the Z. Spacebar, and let's pan up. Extrude and size. This is for the roof. Hit spacebar to accept. Extrude again and Z. And spacebar to accept and size. Size. Oops. Okay, so the problem is we have proportional editing on it, so we want to disable that. And size. And just bring it in there. Just bring it in close. There we go. And now we want to go to the mesh tools. And we want to merge all these points. And merge them at the center. And there we have a completed lighthouse. Uh, we want to render this. And the lighthouse is not quite visible from here, it's right there. The other thing we want to do is get out of edit mode and we want smooth shading for our lighthouse. There we go. And I don't want to mess with the camera anymore, so we'll leave it at that. And that completes this tutorial.